<laughs> you know the run go down side. <laughs> Me just a lick you. They say your sister is funny. Don't miss him. The opening. Mm -hmm. Me family, they say no. I don't like the way they behave. Now give me some space. I need two more. The four. They will buy them for me. Foil pan. No, no, I get foil. No, no, no worry. I get the foil for cover. I the pan they normally need. That's fine. That's fine. I get foil while the cover. I get for buy them tin and they pile them up now. Oops. Okay, are they live? Are they see you in Kaya? Thank you, man. You say eat away, big girl, eh? Fine, girl, last year. Mm hmm. Let me picture you in the book. Yes. Seventy dollars. Seventy, eighty dollars. Yeah. Idea. Seafood is yeah. very expensive. Yeah. I mean, seafood. not the expensive one, but they might be probably why everything can. Mm hmm. I'm gonna see that. Eat for sleep now, not even. Oh, what? I just said, don't move, no, no. Mm hmm. Oh wow. Mm. 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 That's enough. That's that's enough. She said, "That's enough." Then I find me cover, cover this leg with steam. How you guys doing? 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 Come on, let's cook and eat. We're gonna have a we're gonna have a seafood boil night. How you guys doing this evening? Is everybody doing okay? Is everybody having a hangover? Who drink the most last night on Thanksgiving? Huh? Yeah. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Quick, quick. Who drink the most last night? <laughs> huh? I drink. I drink the beer a lot. This lady is the most funniest lady I've seen in my life. <laughs> she said she drink the, the beer last night. <laughs> How you guys doing? Y'all come on, y'all come on, y'all come on. Who want to eat some seafood? Come on, let's eat. Cooking with Chef Ruby family. You guys go follow me now. I'm going to give you guys 10 minutes. Hey, sorry. I'm, I'm going to give you guys 10 minutes to watch me. Go follow Chef Ruby and family. Go follow Chef Ruby and family. Go follow Chef Ruby and family now. If you don't follow Chef Ruby and family, you're going to miss out a lot of videos. You're going to miss out a lot of videos. Go follow Chef Ruby and family. And go buy the best seasonings in the world. The best seasonings in the world. You all see that? So we have crab under. We have um, shrimp. Then we have beef sausages on top. 
Auntie uh, Rose, come along, can enjoy. Then I answer to her, Salamu Alaikum. When I go to the other page, oh, because they can't turn this off right now. Go to the other page right now. Elephant? Elephant, yeah. Help me. Open it. Why, Romeo? Y'all go follow Chef Ruby and family. I'm going to go over there right now. Cooking with Chef Ruby, 57 people. All of you guys go to Chef Ruby and family. If you don't follow me there, you're going to miss a lot of videos. I need to go. You're going to miss a lot of videos. Who want to come join us this night to come eat some good seafood? Come eat some good seafood. The best seafood in the world. Hmm? Ecole. Atlanta, I don't know what's going to go on this year. Atlanta are going to be so cold this year. It's very cold, so I'm going to put some butter on top of this. You have to break the butter and separate the butter. Go sit down. <laughs> Grandma. Grandma Zenam. <laughs> Grandma Zenam. So I'm just putting butter around this. Now you're going to have to cover it i don't know i'm finding my cover this is the perfect cover i'm finding my cover um and you know, say keep me you know at the camp um tomorrow okay they keep some for you i don't know they pick it like seafood though so i don't know if you're gonna meet some in this house i i'm not gonna promise because i don't come to mind say but rudy i'll be telling you like keep them why you not keep them so guys, I'm going to Chef Ruby and family. 90, 94 beautiful people are on Chef Ruby family. She, uh, cooking with Chef Ruby, whatever you call it. Let's go to Chef Ruby and family now. I already um, type in the, the name. Please go Google on Facebook, Chef Ruby and family. So I'm going to let you guys go. This is for catering tomorrow. I'm catering for an office. I'm making uh, my famous honey hot wings. And I'm making some mixed veggies for them. Then I'm going to make some mac and cheese for them. I might go live and show you guys while I'm doing it. I don't know yet. It depends how late and tired I am when I'm finished this seafood. If not, maybe next time I will show you guys. But go follow Chef Ruby and family now. 105 people on Cooking with Chef Ruby. Let's go over to Chef Ruby and family, please. That's my new page. I can receive stars there. And go ahead and bless Chef Ruby with some stars. Love you guys. Love you, love you, love you, love you. Hey, look at this. Oh, you enjoy? Look at these seasonings. Go order your seasonings. Bye-bye. That's why they do the chair. They drag them. Because this old page, again, 120,000 people. Now they begin the new page. So they go there like 10, 15 minutes and tell them in it. Yeah, for join the new page. Now, so... But good people don't even know say I get the new page yet. So you just get for let let them know. Yeah. So are you guys coming? Are you guys coming? Is everybody coming to the new page? So let me show you guys what I'm doing next. What what this uh huh. Miss Lisa said Chef Ruby is a cooking fa fan fanatic. Eh? I'm a cooking fanatic. <laughs> I cook 24 hours a day, right? <laughs> you have to love what you're doing. You have to love what you're doing. Hey, my sister said I love food. <laughs> I don't eat like before though. Governor Abdul. What's up, man? How are you doing? Why are you so quiet today? Governor look quiet today. <laughs> today they play with him. You don't have to fight with nobody. That's why he's quiet. So, guys, I have fresh ginger, fresh garlic. Uh, maybe three to four habanero peppers green onions and regular onions i'm gonna repeat again i'm gonna repeat what i have here fresh onions you know one yellow onions actually i use white onion one white onion um green onions ginger garlic and habanero peppers i'm gonna blend this together let's see did i already plug it
I'll just leave it there. I want you to come help, help me make the sauce. But talk to the jewels. Open that door for me. Let me take this oil outside. I cannot fry this wings in here. I'll walk by another. Okay. Okay. Move away, move away. Go talk to the jewels. I'm coming. Yeah, for, for the cradle. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hello, Kathy. Hello, Melissa. Replace one more. How's your day going today? Replace one. No, no, I'm going to you more. Huh? I need one more for you in my life. I know. I just bundled it. Some. Okay. Hey, Mommy. Mommy, what's in here again? Um, onions. We got onions. Uh, is it habanero pepper? Habanero peppers, ginger garlic, and ginger garlic, and green onions. You can take it green off. onions. Okay, you stay right there. Now I'm gonna make you cook since you're already in this kitchen. Yeah, stay right there. You wanna cook yeah. for mommy? Yeah. Huh? yeah. No. Nope. Yeah, neither the big one. <clears throat> So you're gonna. Ah. Is that not Abu? Or is that not Abu? Abu, 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 when you have a future girlfriend or future wife, eh, 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 baby, no. Turn you said a lot. Okay, listen now. Don't do that. You turn this like this, you grab and dump. That's a lot. Yeah, put more. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't like one other. <laughs> Tell them what you're doing. Tell them, explain what you're doing. What are you doing, Maddie? I don't know. Hey, what did you just do? I put the butter in the pot. Okay. Hold it. Hold the pot. Okay, do that. What do you lemon juice? You get lemon juice? Even this fresh lemon. Have you seen lemon juice? I don't know who said it. You don't like that? Mm hmm? You don't like that? Sometimes. Sometimes you know I'm going like in the shape. So, we're going to put some virgin coconut oil in here. Just to give this some flavor. Maybe one more scoop. Take it out. Ah. Hey, you don't, man, hold this towel. No, fold it, fold the towel on your hand. Okay, now hold it. Aha, uh -huh. mm -hmm. so right. you don't burn yourself. Take the coconut oil. Okay, thank you. So that's how you do that. Mix it and let it melt. Then I'll show you what to put next. Let me move my stuff. I don't play with my coconut oil. I don't play with my um, my seafood boil. Make sure it's melting very good. Wait, this is going on the seafood? Yeah, but it's the sauce we're gonna use to eat it with. Yeah, you have to make the sauce. So, the sauce is melting, right? Mm -hmm. All right, is it melt? Mix it, yeah. you have to let it melt very good. Then it melts. Then I'll show you the next step. You got it? Hmm? <laughs> you don't know how to do You don't got it? So now you're going to pour your blended ingredients in here. Uh -huh. Thank you. You're a good boy. You know what? Smile, yeah. Yeah, you yeah, you have to smile. You have to talk to the jewels. Tell them what you're doing. Uh-huh. 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 Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Talk now. What you doing? I'm getting the, uh, uh -huh. the blended... Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. 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 The, the stuff in the uh, blender. What? And I'm putting it in the pot to uh, mix uh -huh. uh, 
Talk straight, man. You born in this country. I don't know what you're saying. Ah, you born in this country. You're supposed to speak more than me. Uh-huh. Okay, so you put the blended ingredients in the butter and coconut oil. Uh-huh. And what you do? Are you mixing it I'm or mixing you stirring it? it? I'm mixing it. Okay. We're mixing it. All right. So I'm going to take everything we have in this blender and put it in there. Keep mixing it. You have to mix it so everything can join together. That's the sauce. So, depending what you want to make a seafood boil, there's so many ways to make seafood boil. They have like 20. They have like 20 different ways to make seafood boil. You they by eating any weight for the seafood boil. Now see that in a cup bread. Mix it, mix it, let it cook. So Ibrahim, you like seafood? Okay. This will be one of all sit on a table eater. But I don't know when when Uncle they reach here. So now you're gonna season it, right? Season it, Madu. Let me see you season it. Season, let me mix. Which seasoning are you using? I'm using this. Ooh. And put inside my sauce. La, 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 la. The fire burning. Your girlfriend gonna divorce you. What? Yeah. That's how you do it. Let me turn the fire down. You have to turn it down. Okay, now it's down. So you have to season this sauce. Let me put more. Okay, I think that's enough for you. Laugh for you. Know, this, uh, <laughs> oh Lord, you see this guy? I don't think this guy gonna have a wife. Eh? That's how you gonna cook? Oh my gosh. Can you guys see the sauce? <laughs> okay, now taste. Just leave it. You don't have Mom, to hold it. It's steamy. Come taste it. You need cook, you have to what taste it. Taste it. Open your hand. Mommy, it's hot. May I open this hand? Taste. Get him out of there. <laughs> Patricia said, get him out of there. <laughs> they said, if you're okay. Are you okay? Mm-hmm. Hey, you want to taste more? You see? Yeah. Mm-hmm. You Make it. Let me go wash my bottles. Let me wash my bottles. Let me wash my bottles. You don't have to mess up the whole season bottle. You mess up my whole season bottle. What's the apple? You're always going to have the too much. So I'm gonna squeeze my my lime juice or lemon juice in here. Huh? You guys sent stars for Chef Ruby. If you if you like what Chef Ruby is doing, please send stars to support Chef Ruby. Send stars for Chef Ruby. Yes, out of the kitchen, Maru. Maru, they said get out of the kitchen. You guys think Abu can 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 cook better than Maru? I couldn't help but love that a sweet family. Thank you. You think Abu can cook more than you? Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, if it was like breakfast wise, I can cook better than him. Like, like he's good. honest though. I like his honesty. Uh, Carlos said, yes, Abu can cook better than you. Uh, Miss Joy said he will be okay. We all make mistakes, especially when we are young. Definitely. He's going to learn. I need to teach him now at this age. So when he gets older or he goes to college, at least if he feel like eating seafood football, he can go in the kitchen and make it for himself. They, 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 anybody can boil seafood, they eat it. But the sauce, the sauce to eat with your seafood, if you don't know how to make it, is a problem. So I put three slices of lime juice inside. All right. So I'm gonna wipe my hand. Madu, why you run away? Come, let's finish, please. My seafood is boiling over there. 
So you all see this sauce now? Let me taste it myself. You have to make sure, you have to make sure all those um, blended ingredients cook. Oh my God. Oh my God. I need more seasoning. I need to add more seasoning. You have to make it taste good. This, you're just gonna dip your seafood in it and eat. You're gonna take shrimp, peel it, dip it and eat. You're gonna take crab, dip it and eat. <coughs> or, or sometimes you can spray it over your over your seafood. So now you let it cook until it's done. Yeah, perfect. Oh my god, how oh, I want this taste, taste back. Let me know if the seasoning good. Sorry. Good. <laughs> I add this one. So this is the sauce right here. Can you guys see the sauce? Look at it. Look at this sauce. I'm gonna start boil, boil, putting this sauce in a bottle and sell it. Because you cannot find this sauce like this in any seafood restaurant. Most of them, where is salt? Where's my salt? Something is missing. Don't worry, I'll put this. Maybe small chicken bouillon. Okay. Give me the taste that oh, I'm looking perfect. for. Don't worry about it. I don't need salt anymore. That's a little chicken bouillon. I just put so maybe that gonna give me the taste I'm looking for. <coughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Let me taste it again. Perfect. 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 Oh my god, look at this sauce, guys. Look at this sauce. Go make this sauce for your family. If you have a seafood lover family, go make this sauce for them. Let them eat it. Okay, so let's come to the seafood now. The sauce is cooking. I'm gonna turn the fire down. Let me open this. I'll open that. Okay. Oh my god. Seafood heaven. Flip the phone. Seafood heaven. You like seafood? Yeah. Hey, hey. Yes, bro. Everybody mm -hmm. loves seafood. So I'm going to peel my eggs and throw my eggs in there. And I'm going to even start throwing my corn in there. Throw your corn. Throw your potatoes. This, you can make this and sit with your whole family on a table. Everybody just munchy. Carlos Everybody said, do you make just, cakes? I don't make cakes. I don't know how to bake. No, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie to nobody. I ain't gonna lie. I don't bake no cake. No, it's good to be honest, you know? But if I put my head into it, I can bake cakes. Because if you're a cook, you can try anything you want. I might bake some African cake. You know that pancake? How do they call them? Pancake. <laughs> I don't know who's going to eat my African cake though, but I can bake some. I can bake African sweet pancake. I'll just look up the recipe and bake it. Do you guys remember the cake? Was it a cake? I tried to bake something one time. It was a disaster. You know? I probably have to go to school to learn how to bake. You can go to school for that, right? I mean, to become a, a baker. A baker. Yeah. I will add that to my recipe, to my resume. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want to bake wedding cakes. I want to bake wedding cakes. But I think wedding cakes is a lot of work. Yeah. For you to build those mountains, eh? Some people would get like six mountains of cakes or ten. The rich people. So if somebody go tell me to make like six mountain of cake, oh my gosh, that cake gonna scatter everywhere. The party is gonna be over as soon as I enter with that cake. <laughs> the party gonna be over right away. Cause the cake gonna scatter everywhere in the hall. You know, you have to stick with what you know best. I love cooking. You know, I love to cook regular food, so I'm gonna stick to that. 
Sometimes when you force yourself to do something that you don't know, you just want to force yourself just because or just to make money. It's a problem. It's a disaster. So, let me show you guys what I'm going to do. You all see my sauce? I'm going to show them this sauce. You all see this sauce? This is how you make seafood sauce. When you go to that juicy crab, you go to those places, oh my gosh. Mm -mm. The sauce is something else. Too much butter, too much seasonings. You don't even enjoy seafood. When they just open, it used to be good, but now, mm -mm. I can barely go there to eat. So that's why you need to learn how to make your own. So I'm just gonna leave this like this and go cover it and let it steam. If the seafood is already, it's already ready, so you're just going to leave it in here, let it steam until everybody is ready to eat. Now to show them. Who love my seafood? Hey, look at this pot. Who want to come grab the pot? Come take the pot home. Take a screenshot of the pot. We are still Thanksgiving. We are still Thanksgiving in this house until Sunday before our Thanksgiving is over. Thank you, Madu, for helping. Get a plate. Let me put some for you. Or you want to wait so all of us can sit on the table and eat? You wait? Okay. You burn yourself, so I want to let you eat first. Madam Chef, Shaker. nothing wrong with um, sticking with with what you know and good at it. Yes, definitely. Huh? I am at the door. Hey, Hazel, go open the door for Hazel. Hazel says she's at the door, Madu. Go open the door. Hazel is coming to eat. Hey, nobody loves Chef Ruby. Send stuff for Chef Ruby now. Oh, you know there's like people that will actually come and take the pot. But how are they going to come if they don't know my address? Exactly. <laughs> hey, they have to come midnight after I sleep. They come midnight. They're going to fly in that plane. You know that plane? I don't want to call the plane. That's the only way you can come here and take this pot. So if you love this seafood, send stuff for Chef Ruby. I'm receiving stars now. So somebody bless Chef Ruby with some stars. I want some Ruby. I have, wait, I, I want some Ruby. Live too far, Texas, Texas Waco. Eh? By the time you get here, I don't know what's going to happen. Send, send some to B-Love. Okay, I'll send some to you, Carlos. Oh, B-Love, yes, that lady, right? That lady that used to do um, TikTok and YouTube. I don't see her for a very long time. She make all her money and disappear. Them, they want to start making money on this Facebook. <laughs> Joy said, I wish the phone was grab vision and, and, and smell vision. Eh? I'm going to tell Apple to make phones to grab food <laughs> through the phone. I'm going to contact Apple. Look at these guys. Oh, my God. Look at this seafood. Please go make some for yourself. I know of millions of people out there, they are seafood lover. Thank you guys for all the love you guys are sending. Thank you guys for all this, the... the, the the support. Who like the seafood? Come on, come get some. Hi, Tara. How are you? Thanks for watching. Hi, Caroline. Thanks for watching. Hi, Felicia. How you doing? Enjoy your eyes. Oh. Enjoy your eyes. Oh. That's all you can do. Enjoy your eyes. We were going to enjoy our mouth tonight. So I'm cooking for company. I'm going to do mixed vegetables tomorrow. I'm going to make some wings. I already washed these wings and seasoned it with my all-purpose seasonings. Then I'm going to fry them. I'm going to fry this tonight, actually. Tomorrow morning, I'll just put them in the oven and deliver them, you know. Because these people want their food sharp 1030. If I said I have to wake up and cook, I'm not going to make it in time. But the veggies, I'm cooking it in the morning. I'm cooking a lot of wings tonight. I have like two full pans of this I'm going to cook. Uh, Miss Alicia said it looks good and it tastes good. Food is not all about luck. Food is taste. Thank you for 300 stars, Miss Lane. Thank you for blessing me. Thank you for blessing my pot. Thank you so much. Uh, Carlos said, Ruby, teach yourself to make cakes. Hey, Carlos, don't put too much trouble on my head. Even this cooking is difficult. If I come add cake again, it's a problem. Mm -mm. Let the cake people stay with their cakes. Let me stay with my food. You know, if I want cake, I go to Publix. <laughs> you know how many cakes I've trashed right now? Huh? Sweet potato pie, apple pie, everything that was up there. None of this, would, nobody ate it, so I trash it. So I'm not going to waste my time on cakes. No. Whenever I feel like, the only cakes I like, 
The only cakes I like to eat is pound cake with no sugar. I love pound cake with, with no sugar. If it's not too sweet, I like it. And um, I love carrot cake. So I cover my seafood and let it steam. It's going to steam till we, all of us, we are ready to eat. We might go back live and show you guys how to eat seafood. Because a lot of people out there, they don't know how to eat crab. Hi, Miss L. How are you? She said, hi, you all going to get some more of your seasonings. Go ahead and get it. The best seasonings in the world. Go ahead and grab it. So, actually, I have 15% um, off on the website. Um, the code is, um, what's the code again? Black Friday. The code is Black Friday. So, go on the website and go grab some seasonings. I have 15% off for Black Friday. So, go there, go grab some please that's an extra discount i'm giving you guys go to the website internationalflavorscuisine.com go order your spices 15 percent off the code is black friday all right so those of you that chef ruby do you have any special chef ruby yeah, yeah, yeah. They, you don't want to pay for shipping hmm? go help yourself that's like free shipping 15 percent is like almost free shipping so go 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 add more seasoning christmas is coming new year's eve is coming you're gonna cook for a lot of family some people their family since they come from their different states for thanksgiving they're gonna stay with them till new year's till after new year so please go grab your seasoning and cook for your family uh, Miss Kathleen said, everyone can do everything. There's someone for every area. That's, that's the, what? That's their, that's theirs. She, eh, this English. When I say for sometimes, for the one they write, who will not go to school so when they go to I don't know read it now. Eh, he said, that's their, that's their chef bakers. That's, okay, I know what she means. She said they are bakers. Um, painters and so on leave my leave my chef leave my chef for thank you kathleen thank you kathleen for saying that but i understand what kathleen is saying you see even in the medical field one doctor cannot do everything i went to my doctor for eye then i tell my eye doctor i feel pain on my hands he said go to the, the hand doctor downstairs you understand mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. he said go to the hand doctor downstairs i don't do hand he he referred me there uh -huh. then you go to your medical doctor you say i feel pain on my back he said go to the back doctor the, is across the street chiropractor go go to chiropractor let them go check you huh African doctor. <laughs> My sister said, only African doctor can do everything. A doctor in Africa, you go for headache, he going to tell you, you have ulcer. You go, <laughs> you, go for, you go for eye problem, they're going to check your stomach, they think you're pregnant. They say maybe you're pregnant. African doctor, <laughs> you go for toothache, they say, Oh, the toothache, you have a... Come like, I help me, but now you did at the medical field. <laughs> Anything you have in Africa, they're going to tell you. You go for one sickness, they will diagnose you for 50. Then they will give you medication, a whole suitcase of medication. You don't even know where the medication came from. So only in Africa, they have a doctor that do everything. But in America, they have hand doctor, they have eye, they have teeth, they have nose. They have, okay, the nose and ear doctor, I think they are the same. EMT, that's how they call them. The nose and the, no, wait, oh, I think the, the nose, the ear, and the throat. I think it's one doctor. Because I think these three things connected. Am I right, students? You don't know? I think I'm right. Am I right, Jules? This nose, nose, <laughs> that one, okay. Nose, ear, and, I mean, I and throat. I think it's one doctor. The one in the but eye is different. So why eye doctor is different from the from the throat and the ear and, and the nose? Why? Because eye, nose, ear, mouth, throat, everything is surrounded. So I don't know why they have ENT. Yes, I call it right. I don't know why they have different doctor for eye. 
Then the eye doctor gonna say, go to the nose doctor, go to the throat doctor, go to the ear doctor. You know? So everybody is specialized in their own way. Me, I'm specialized in cooking, in recipe. That's how I created my seasonings. So let me stay there. If I tell me to bake cake, you're going to come eat it. Because after you eat it, the whole light, you're going to be close to the bathroom. Because I'll put baking soda. I'll put yeast. I'll put uh, nutmeg. I'll put cinnamon. I'll put uh, gunpowder. I'll put... <laughs> I'll put gunpowder, I'll put everything in that cake, you know, because I'm not specializing cake. I watched one movie where they bake a cake. I don't know, maybe you guys know that movie. Was it a movie or comedy or whatever? You know, then this person bake the cake and go deliver the cake. Oh my gosh, it was a disaster. I don't know if it was comedy show I watch or movie. Miss Kathleen said, I think maybe they all... They all to the back of the neck area, okay? No, your bro. Anyway, it's the connection, guys. Sometimes the phone go on and off, you know. But I'm gonna leave you guys now. We're gonna come get ready to eat the seafood for you guys. Um, Miss um, Singling Singlington said you can be a comedian if you decided to stop cooking. Hey, I don't know for comedian though. You know, I don't know. Mm -mm. I don't know for comedian. I don't know. Mm -mm, I don't think so. You know, because for me to even get used to this Facebook, I really have to empower myself to do it. Before I'm like, I cannot do it with this English. And I don't know if these people are going to understand me. I don't know if they're going to accept me, whatever. You know, it takes me time for me to get used to this. So for me to go stand on a stage and become a comedian where you have to make fun, either they laugh or they don't laugh, oh no, I'm not going to put myself there. <laughs> let me stay right here where I am. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm, I'm going to let you guys go. Then we're going to come back and eat. Thank you so much for the um, stars. May God bless you guys. And I'll be right back. Love you guys. Bye-bye.